Oh, we got gloves. Crit and int. Wow. Super good. Super good. Can I, like, actually enchant them, though? What would I put on gloves that I might use on my other character also? Ah, hell, I don't know. I should probably just put whatever. Frenzy. Cost five of those. Okay. What does it cost here? Nothing special there. That's good. And what does it cost here? Nothing special. Good. And what does it cost here? Nothing special. Good. Oh, wait. I was using the wrong thing. I'm a dumbass. This thing. If I want to temper. It does cost Forgotten Souls. Well, damn. Okay. And if I want to do this... Okay, it doesn't cost anything extra here, at least. Um... Jesus, the core skills? Oh my god. That's an outrageous bone spirit glove. That's outrageous. I can't touch it. I cannot I cannot use this item right now. We have to pretend we didn't get it. It's to get plus two core skills is extremely rare, and that's the exact role that you need. So, yeah. It's just gonna stay the way it is. Protector, we got another hardened bones, I guess. Uh, let's maybe gamble a little bit. Okay, we can try pants. Wow. Okay, we got pants. Um, is helmet cheap? No. Tunic gloves, boots are also cheap. Well, yeah, because they don't have many stats on them. What's that? Empty tomb. Racking off. The boot, actually. CDR all resists. Non fizz. Okay, the pants. All right, well, hardened bones, right? I mean, 20 is pretty good. That takes five. Tortured gifts, dark citadel, undercity, infernal hordes. That is hard to recover. This doesn't take anything though. Okay, so that's fine. Armor. Armor will do for now. Um, temper, do I have legendary? Actually, don't. Don't have legendary. Uh, 
that takes mats also. Curse size versus nothing. Like, yeah, we'll use it. Game. Okay, that should be a pretty big deal. Of these bone spirit, yeah. Okay, the 4k life now. Uh, let me sort out this thing. Have it going this way, so. He's worth damage armor. Eh, it's actually not too bad. I don't know if it's really worth it, but it's not too bad. And we have some golem damage. You know, I don't know if golem damage is actually worth it. I mean, you build all the way through. I don't know. I don't know what I'm planning. Right now, this is this isn't even one of the minion builds that I plan to go. It's kind of a hybrid between Golem and Mindeln. So even even this, I don't I don't know what this is. Um, I should probably just keep doing some of this nightmare sigil stuff as long as I have these flasks up. Um, for Dragon Barracks, why not? The new chest is juicy. You got Infernal Horde's key. Nice. I need more time. Nightmare dungeons are great, but you're really just fishing the whole time. Just killing random mobs does not have much of a payout. You're fishing for like resplendent chests, for events, for completions. Still has okay stats actually. Probably try to see if I can masterwork that at least a four. Confusing. Minion slap. We control the minions.
money. Five mil, wow, such such wealth. Class is part of the 17 damage club now. I mean, yes and no. I loot minions kill, right? I'm basically a walking slot machine for loot. Crit and armor. Actually, pretty good stats. I think I might need to drop the int for something a little more speedy, though. See what hell tides like. This looks so easy. Yep. Pretty easy. Helltide, we want to focus on like the pieces that cost more. Right? Like we can do armor, we're going to like gloves. I gamble gloves. Cost extra. I kind of doubt anyone's going to spawn the lady there. I'm basically doing like kind of a rounds of content to just kind of see where it's at. They rebalanced everything after the closed testing. So it's hard to know exactly where it's at. And resource. Bro, that's bullshit. The screaming vein that literally is modeled after Forgotten Souls does not drop Forgotten Souls anymore.
The Forgotten Souls bottleneck is gonna be brutal. I promise you. Good, I do a weapon. Weapon would be a pretty big upgrade. I feel like weapons drop disproportionately high amount. I think I should focus on armor that is expensive on the vendor, like helms and gloves. I think that's what I should do, yeah. regression in a lot of systems it's not they just slowed things down a little bit but overall I think it's it's all good changes so but yeah you won't get your stuff quite as quickly That was Forgotten Soul. One. Well, at least you get it that way. This screaming hell vein. Two iron chunks. This one gave me six. Bro, that's fucking criminal. They... They removed... The Forgotten Souls from the the vein that looks like Forgotten Souls. It's modeled after it. And didn't replace it with anything. Like it, it just it just gives you less iron chunks than the shit node. That's everywhere. Cultists, Harbingers, and that dude, and Hellborn. Damn, this is busy. 12 minutes? Yeah, I don't, I don't know about that. 12 minutes sounds a little tight. Am I mining with the correct pickaxe? Alright, Mr. Minecraft. They don't have that here. This, this is ideal here. One glove. Good. Okay. Maybe we do the mysteries. There's another sample size. Two iron chunks. Nah, it's, it's actually... They took away Forgotten Souls from the Hell Vein. That's a rare spawn only in Helltide, and didn't replace them with anything. So now it just gives you less stuff than every other... <laughs> Why? It's like the neighbor that, that borrows your stuff and never never gives it back to you. Cursed, man. Well, the um, 
And the splinter acquisition rate is pretty good, at least. I don't know if I'm gonna summon it myself. Maybe I should. Heldite seems fairly worth, like. Maybe even more so than Nightmare Dungeons. Okay. It's three. Oh no. That's some other crap I'm doing. Okay, yeah, it's still three. I don't have a neighbor that takes my stuff and doesn't give it back to me anymore, okay? We have pretty good neighbors right now. Bought the whole neighborhood. Look, like I said, they're pretty good neighbors. They like burst her down. Nah, uh, she has actually got like a lot of health. Five levels from Helltide. Helltide as a whole seems very decent. Nightmare Dungeons, very decent. That new content, Undercity? Garbage. And the funny thing is, on the closed test realm, it was the literal opposite. I mean, I'll be honest, I don't really mind doing Helltide. I kind of like doing Helltide. I mean, I've, I've done it a lot. I have. But I don't mind doing Helltide. Living steel off that guy. Pretty good. Wow, that looked like a lot of BXP. Oh, elevated ring. Man. Got a lucky hit, but also has attack speed. Oh, we get a, another boss here. Freebie boss. Heart times one, not the worst. No, oh, we got sacrilegious soul. Yeah, the mystery box seems really good actually. Oh, what the hell? It's perfectly rolled. Hmm. 
have to use uh, Reapers though. <laughs> Let's go, um, put two handed weapons. Jesus, still, still dropping. Sound. Does the rain count as you consuming corpses? Yes, it does. Lucky hit attacks. 12 resist. It's not bad. Three minutes left. Did we do everything? I think we actually did everything, yeah. Try to find another good chest and see if we can farm to it. Heavy weapon, 150. Maybe doable. Chest armor, not worth it. Oh, I don't have elixirs. Additional equipment. and health hide. Yeah, seems quite good. Over chest, pretty good. Oh, light weaponry is the same as heavy weaponry? Damn, one hander's getting scammed here. Oh, that guy's 93. Damn. Higher level than I am. Very nice. Actually, I don't know if I can finish that in time. I need 25, but I need them, like, immediately. That was the chest, I believe. That is indeed the one that I need, but there's no mobs. Now we need to get pretty lucky here. Two, come on, just drop, drop me two. One, two, got it. Got it. Wait, where's the 
where's the rest? What the fuck is that? Holy shit. Yeah, dude, the... The chests are garbage. The... The mysteries are good. Everything else, terrible. Okay. Now the guys actually do pick up the abductite. Are drops enabled? I mean, yeah, whenever that thing's supposed to start. Is it supposed to start now? That's very good. Yeah, I, I'll have them when the time comes. Okay, time for some sweet event EXP. that one. In this one I have Flesh Eater, but I'm not going to be using quite as many corpses. But yeah, I don't know. There's animus holders, but there's no animus. This is like some half-baked dungeon here. Yeah. <laughs> boss. Boss mobs drop an animus. No animus. Just go up and kill the boss.
Ooh, what's that? Ants. Double. Wow. I mean, they are slightly better than mine, but I'm not going to re-imprint. So, it is what it is. Gotten quarry. Oh, we got a compass. Okay, let's try the horde. Scent of death might be worth damage to injured. Yeah, it's got damage reduction nodes. Alternatively, flesh eater is kind of bad. Yeah, I think it's going to be scent of death essence for me. Did nothing. Hopefully this is not too bad. Nah, they're getting crushed. is fantastic here. Actually, too much stuff going on. How many revives do I have? Revives four. Okay, that's actually pretty good. It's like two or something before, right? It's like a sensible number. The amount of rapport you get in this is actually insane. 
I think for leveling mercs, it's maybe the best. But I'm not sure if mercs get experience. I think they, they have like a separate rapport mechanic. Double faster spawn, I guess. Is Torment do the same as World Tier 2? No. <laughs> Not quite. Okay, three of those, I guess. Monsters are actually doing a ton of damage. I didn't particularly like the campaign. I'm sure it was like well done or whatever, but I didn't particularly like it because um, uh, it's just so much just like waiting for shit to happen. It feels like most of it is just wasting time waiting for the NPC to finish talking. And I think if it felt meaningful to hear what they say, I'd be into it, but it, it doesn't. So, yeah.
I mean, that felt like it went pretty well. The rewards are a little bit underwhelming. Regardless. Gem fragments. Oh. Oh, what is what is all this? Oh my god, it's it's still dropping. Holy crap. This is like the most valuable item in the game at this point. <laughs> okay. Oh, those are fantastic boots. Uh, the sword is garbage. Rana Lucian. Again. Oh, that one's bad. Ocran's. Terrible rolls. Yeah, 160 is probably not worth it. I think the gold is better. That was good. We got another one. are good. Probably roll the resist off. Three charges, also good. Yeah, boots are, boots are very good. I kind of want to get those boots online over anything else right now. I'll keep the sword. I'm not crazy about it. I'll keep that. I'm not crazy about it. Boots are nice though. Mercenaries. Oh yes. Gib loot. Tons of living steel, huh? Does this still take, like... Oh, I have 20 now! Whoa, okay. Well, we could, like, use an item now. So what? Alright, bro. It's clearly trying to do something else here. Uh, 
defense, worldly endurance is still magic, so yeah, I guess I guess I leave that as is. Uh okay, fine, let's get the boots online. Corpse explosion size, of course. Corpse explosion size, of course. Corpse tendrils, yes. And for mobility, no, we have to wait, so I can use them. I think I use the all resists. I do use the all resists. Huh. Okay. Hmm. All right then. Actually, no. We're we're melting those. Okay. What about the men down? What's the cost of masterwork? That does not look too bad. Minion attack speed. Excellent. Just leave that as is. I guess we leave, we leave all of it as is. Okay. We still have XP buff right now. What's happening here? Uh, Helltide is happening here. Mercenaries part of the season or expansion? Uh, they're in the expansion area, so yeah, that's another expansion thing. I think for Helltie, we really just go for uh, the Mysterious Chest. The only one that gave anything good, but it, get, it gave me lots of good stuff. Not like, not like a little. Okay, what do I have for quests? Cinders, Harbingers, Mom. And it's a two zone. Got it. Okay, so we only need 500. We can try to do that pretty quickly. I have the XP potion thingy. Did not want to attack that one. Waves of Darkness is superb.
Yeah, we need to get the um the tempering manuals for those. I think Ragnoth's Wake with stacked resists is what uh, Spiritborns use. I think those boots are actually crazy for Spiritborn. Reroll time? Nah. And I got them so early, probably the best thing to do is uh, sell them to like some guy who has a lot of money uh, and then just live on the beach for the rest of my days. I don't know if they're quite that good though, but uh, maybe they are. Why is it with the uptime command? Is that something that people do when they're like streaming for a long time? That seems so dumb. Like why not just stream because you enjoy what you're doing? Is that like illegal? Life int. Very nice. Oh, I'm done with whispers. Okay, so let's do whispers. Hadn't realized. Two-handed. Giga. Giga two-hander. No? No. Oh, they're still dropping. Some last minute grandfather, maybe. It's still still dropping. Holy shit! <laughs> yeah, we got Necromotion, which is the best one. And it's all bad though. Got some aspects though. Playing WoW well again? Yeah, it crossed my mind, but uh, I basically decided against it ultimately. Cultists and the lady. Basically, this might sound kind of dumb. But, like, the single craziest thing is the damn Whisper Cache. You kind of need to let the Whisper Cache dictate what you're doing. It's just that good. Raid Leader Crypt. 
I didn't, um... Isn't Vex a good one? Vex is a really good one. Oh, damn. Um, I did a pretty good job with ray leading, but I think I did an even better job at, like, co-raid leading. Like, being, being the number two. That, or I don't know. Like, I mostly raided in Exodus when K-Warrior was leading, and K-Warrior is just, like, a ridiculously good raid leader, too. Yeah, basically, I'd just, like, tell him who's sucking and, uh... do most of the strats. But I wouldn't, like, tell him. I'd just, like, tell him what I think, and he'd just make the call. That worked pretty well. Alright. What are we doing here? Uh, gold? No. Equipment. Let's do equipment. Wayward Soul. Uh, Wayward Soul is pretty bad before, but okay. Let's say I saw Shark. I don't know. I think... Uh, I think these days there's like this this bullshit thing centered around like being alpha and like the alpha thing is just really some boneheaded absolute moron but like that's kind of what's put out there for it but really like you know in some way recognizing what you're best at and then doing that in a team environment is really like the best like i don't know beta takes i guess so yeah Let's go hit that thing before I get one-shotted by something. Holy crap! Dude, look at that! I'm telling you! Don't even think about clicking on the other chests. Every other chest is just a scam. Mysterious chest only, okay? Only. When you get the mysterious chest, just get the fuck out of Helltide. It's like not even worth your time being there. Every mysterious chest I clicked on has been amazing. Every non-mysterious chest I clicked on, it felt like I got a quarter of the loot I should have. Have to solo it again now. Never anyone here. Oh wait, that's an amulet. Armor on amulet is actually best for uh, spirit bar. What's the other stat? And yeah, life isn't too bad actually. Oh yes, of course. After I use up fucking all three. Oh, Groth is playing, that's cool. Con 
control. Jesus, glyph of control. How long does that take? Phaser. Her loot kind of sucks, but she drops these uh, these like rare patterns like crazy. Uh, we did not clear. We killed four more cultists. Mark is pretty bad with handling the pixel pull. He just like punts them all away. What? Isn't what good? The Crepify. No. What is what? Um. What? Silent chest was pretty good. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna get some keys actually. It's from the this guy, right? Where's the third merc? Yeah, dude. Why only two? Yeah, the water's red under that's pretty cool. I'm gonna say weird, but it's it is kinda cool actually. It's, it's like blood water, it just highlights it in, in some unique way. I guess I haven't tested the uh the living steel chest. Maybe that's okay. Dude spawned it. Yeah, all right. Triple digits. Ants. Skeleton Mage Mastery. There, I'll put one more if you guys want to do them. 
That went pretty well. There's like four people here. So. Oh, two-hander. Two-hander. I told you, this chest is absolutely ridiculous. Oh, it's an axe. Why has it got to be an axe? I mean, I'm sure it's better, but... I think an axe is the literal worst. You don't use the implicit at all. Uh, wait, there's no living steel chest anymore? Huh. Do the mysterious chest still reset like twice an hour? Is that like a thing that happens still? Life and damage. Living steel can be in the adjacent zone. Oh, okay. I'll give that a try, I guess, after this. Yeah, actually just drops really good temper temper manuals. Do we have one? I'm just gonna click on the amulets. One amulet is so fucking sad. Yeah, it it's really mysteri mysterious or nothing is is hell tied right now. Living steel, no. So you've seen a living steel chest, uh, like this this expansion. Ooh, hell tide just keeps on giving, man. They were removed? Okay. Heavy weaponry, 115. It's just like, it's gonna be like three items. think I really need the movement speed anymore. We're nuking this, yes? Yes, we are. So much good loot. So right now I'm playing a build in between Mendown and Golem. Um, most of my damage is Mendel, but I'm not sacrificing the Golem. 
And that's mostly so I can maintain the use of corpse mechanics. That's it. Is that worth? Maybe. Oh, boss time. I just really like the Bone Golem, because he drops so many corpses. Like a few Forgotten Souls in there, so that's actually not bad. damage is this? 72. Like more of everything else though. But yeah, it'll it'll compensate hundred percent. heavy also. Yep. Three items this time. Oh, even better. Two items. Yeah, fuck this. There's absolutely no way this is worth my time. up Lord Zir, you get whispers. Interesting. Okay, what about the PvP zones? Have they reset? Not really, no. Forbidden City. Can you see if... Oh, I have another Infernal Horde. That was pretty amazing. Yeah, we still have the loot. Let's do Horde. Your download takes 24 hours from 37 gigs. Man, that really sucks. Goat dudes hit like way too hard. I 
This is Hellborn. Not bad. Let's try Soul Spires. I don't, know. I don't really like Soul Spires. But Summon Necro good this season. It's uh, at least good, yeah. Crazy. Fire there, no, but that was spawn one at least. Hellborn Invigorate. I'll do the event one. We have to get 200 for the good chest, but I think we will. We're on track for it, and usually this kind of accelerates in rewards. You can keep up anyway. Okay, can. The eagle build for Spiritborn is nuts. Didn't they like change some stuff? Just to the invigorate Hellborn, I guess. I took the Soul Spires and I haven't gotten a single Soul Spire since I took the upgrade. That was two waves ago. How the fuck does that work? Souls fire.
50. Yeah, I'll do it. They didn't really seem like they did any damage. And 15 is quite a bit. You get like 15 plus 36, so it's like guaranteed to actually push me over the edge. Been awake for 18 hours. Uh, well, no, I've been awake for more than that now. Buff damage by 50%. I don't, I don't think that matters. Damage feels way higher than earlier, so I don't think that matters. And there was like an extra guy last time. I got a... guy this time. CDR lidless wall with near perfect rolls on everything. Really? Dude, it's like 1% off perfect with CDR roll. Oh, wait, the bottom one. Oh no, that's just chance. That the the ability power is not that important. Rakanoth, Enduring, Double Pants, so much loot. And if I do this, what do I actually get exactly? Okay, that's not worth it. I think we almost certainly have to do gold. Enduring faith with healing. I mean, I'll keep it, but I think it sucks. That one definitely sucks. Uh. Yeah, well, you can't win them all, I guess. Fire resist thorns. Mm -mm. Pretty good, though, overall. Pretty good. Still pretty bad. How can I help? Don't ruin all that work. Uh, 
The boots, though, should be ready. Because they got the necromotion. Women's speed. Good. Oh, it does actually cost Forgotten Souls. Man. Costs a lot, too. It's take a long time to get this gear going. Long time. And that my worldly endurance is still garbage here. So I'm picking Scent of Death over the corpse one. Scent of Death has the DR. And a pretty bad board, though. Hmm. Yeah, there has two life nodes, which is effectively the same. I guess the choice is fine, actually. Go for that node first. Okay. The flasks drop at 400 there. What is the the rune transmute? What is that? Is that on the occultist? Where's the rune thing? Jewelry. That's weird. Rune crafting. So three of the same runes, 15% chance to get higher, 85% chance to get a different rare. Seems terrible. There's not enough. Wait, what? I crafted a yaks. I got a Fio. There's not enough material. I'm so confused right now. Air of Perdition, what do I need? Six jaw, six K and six gar. Okay. Is any any of those hard to get? I already got four gars. Okay. Give me a second here.
What's next? Helltide. Okay, yeah, excellent. Uh, we'll go from there. Yes, of course. Additional equipment. Attack speed. Oh wait, that kind of sucks. You're spoiling him. Yeah. Noted. It's it's not the same for humans, okay. Yeah, minions are pretty good. No, I, I didn't sleep. Oh, what's this? Am I in it? No, I'm not in health mode. Play demons while he opens the sarcophagus. I've never seen this event before. I had like a red hue. Thought it was in health hide. But I'm not. I'll just do it because I'm curious if it's like something very unique. I don't know. Maybe it is. Looking chest, though. That one actually gave two of the uh, bounty material, which is terrible, but it's interesting. Is this the three? This is the three. So do, do the chests reset at all? Double daily here, actually. Okay, so I'll stay in this zone a little while. Keep it doesn't.
amazing expansion doing the same content. I mean... I mean, yeah. So? What of it? Yeah, these are paragon levels that we're that we're doing now. Checking the amulets for plus skills because that is usually going to be more significant than whether whether it's ancestral or not. At least at this point in the game. zone no they're not I do those oh I also wanted to do the the chest I guess I can backtrack later for that though Day streams, I just start them at night. Easy.
big chests at the end are usually quite rewarding. Not that one, though. Why not T4? Are you scared? Uh, I think we'll make the move to T3 after we actually get some glyphs in order. We have to get back into pit for that. We're like attacking some random shit over there. Decent loot. For these. See that one? Oh, I see it now. The seasonal mechanic is elixirs that drop from realm walker dudes. Yeah, it is pretty confusing. Oh, there's a legion event in a helltide. Yeah, I guess we're gonna go do that. 30 minutes remain. Yeah, we are definitely gonna go do that. But it does require, like, other people to be there. Yes. Is there nobody here? Here. Oh, there's one person. There's two people? Did two dots. No, those are my minions. Literally one person. I mean, I'm open to try. Maybe it works. How long we got? Three minutes? I'll be back in a second. Okay. Do I have another thing here? No. No. Chapter complete. Okay. What's next? Craft elixirs at the alchemist. I'm one off on this. Rank 5 Zacharum. Okay. Light commanders. I have none of these? Oh no, I have plenty of those. Minions, summoned, realm walker. 
Opals. Like mobs spawning around me or something. The timer on that one minute. I think mobs were spawning. I mean, okay, fine. just nuke it. It's really expensive to craft ancestral gear, so if it's like one bad stat and that's the ancestral, yeah, the other stats are higher, but economically it is a poor choice. I think the clear speed is quite high at this point, so yeah. Should be fine. Hmm. Probably in like um, two, three hours, I'm gonna feel pretty good. Right now, it's still like the time when I'm normally asleep. Always the hardest. even good XP. I'm not even sure. It feels like normal health. Time. Maybe worse. There's more mobs, but like the XP per time? I don't know. White bald can still not X. So your secondary mark levels at half the rate. I recommend putting that guy as your secondary mark, because when he's your primary mark, casts Vuln on you. Yeah. And the guy's like, oh, I'm gonna do so much damage. And because he's supposed to do so much damage, he Vulns you, like, the whole fucking time. So the only way you can level him without him ruining your character is by having him as the secondary merc, which he's pretty good at, by the way, to be fair. But the secondary mark levels at half the rate. Bro, that's it. 
That's the, that's the Legion. Legion in Helltide. Not even one level. Six items. No, like, OP unique. Oh. I guess we got that, though. Oh. Sure. Is it good? No. It sucks. Okay, let's do this zone. Where is the chest? Is there no chest? Oh, it's underneath the fucking burial. I didn't even know it could spawn there. This is a good event. I mean, it's not too bad, right? Like one other of those. All right. Quite a few obols from those, though, at least. Enjoying so far? Yeah, it is It is a bit samey, though. You still have to do, like, tons of Helltide. You still have to do Nightmare Dungeon. You still have to do tons of Pit. But the systems are better. Otherwise, the juggling of the numbers, your piece. Bit of a bust on this run. 